In this tutorial, you will learn how to set up and create blogs. Blogs can be searched for by topic on HAR's Real Estate Articles and Blog website found on HAR.com. Blogs are ideal for agent promotion, listing promotion, and lead generation, as all blog posts contain an agent's contact information and call to action buttons that drive leads to you. To get started, log into the members only area. In the search bar, type blog, then choose manage your blog from the results. The first time you come to the site, you will be given three options to set up your blog. The first option is to create a new blog. The HAR Blog Builder allows members to create a blog for free. Your blogs will be posted on your HAR agent or company website along with being searchable on HAR's real estate articles and blog website. The second option is to use an external blog and import posts. This option allows you to import your posts from an existing blog to gain more exposure. Your blogs will be posted on your HAR agent or company website, along with being searchable on HAR's real estate articles and blog website. The last option is to use an external blog, but do not import posts. If you have an existing blog hosted by another website, you can simply designate your blog address to promote it on your HAR agent or company website. However, your posts will not be displayed on HAR's real estate articles and blog website. After you've made your selection, at the bottom of the page, you will need to agree to the terms of use and content policy of the HAR blog. Then click Set Up My Blog button. You will be directed to the Manage Your Blog page. Any field with a red asterisk must be filled in. Type in your blog name, add a tagline. This is a way for you to showcase your business's brand, a short blog description, and a blog welcome message. It is not required, but you can select up to three blog categories. You can choose to allow or not allow comments. With either choice, enter your email address to receive a notification when there is a new comment added to your blog. Under subscribers, you can choose to allow subscribers or not. A subscriber will be notified when a new post is added to your blog. Choose a color pattern and click submit. Once you have set up your blog, you will be directed to the Manage Your Blog dashboard. You will see a horizontal menu of tabs. The Post tab is considered the dashboard. Once you start blogging, this page will display the analytics of your blogs and all of your blog posts. Working through the horizontal menu, the second one is Comments. On this page, you can update your comments settings. Notice that this information can also be accessed under the Edit Blog horizontal tab. Back in the comments section, you can view any comments you've received. The next horizontal tab is Subscribers. You can update your subscriber settings. This information can also be found in the Edit Blog horizontal tab, then click Audience. Click back to the Subscribers tab. You will see your list of subscribers. Hover over one of them the delete button will appear. Click add subscriber to manually input an email address. The next horizontal tab is localize. On this page, you will see any blog post you've created. Click the localize post to select a market area, zip code, city, county, or subdivision. Notice that when I click publish, a pop-up asks if I want to notify my subscribers. The next tab is free content. Many new bloggers create their first blog using the free content that NAR provides from houselogic.com. For more information, click on the HouseLogic link. Below in the search field, type in keywords for your blog post. Hover over the articles until you see create post. The platform automatically generates the post. Note that you can enter a date to post the blog. 
The system defaults to today, but you can set it for a future date. This is handy if you create your blogs on a specific day of the month and want to post them later. To personalize the post, you can film and add a video introducing yourself. Make any changes as you see fit. Down below, you can add up to three categories. Localize the post and choose your comments preference. Check that you have read the terms of use and click publish. The next horizontal tab is promote. Click on share with client. You can share your blog with your contacts or enter up to five email addresses at a time. Below, there are links to social media platforms and email. Depending on your blog type, which we chose at the beginning, your blog may or may not be promoted on HIR's real estate articles and blog website. The blogs I create are, as indicated here. Below is your location information. By default, Office City and Zip are used from Find a Real Estate Agent on HAR. As a benefit of being an MLS Platinum subscriber, you may customize the City and Zip. This is called Customize Find a Pro, which is found by searching for it in the Members Only Portal. Going back to Manage Your Blog, under the Design tab, choose a color pattern for your blogs. We've already viewed some of the Edit Blog tab. In the vertical menu to the left, you can edit your settings and data, such as blog name, description, welcome message, and categories. The RSS feed is where you can add your RSS feed to import posts from an external blog and display them on HAR's real estate articles and blog website. You can deactivate your blog at the bottom of the page. We previously viewed the audience and comments in the vertical menu. With any change you make, you can click the preview button to see what your blog looks like. Here's another place where subscribers can be added. To review, we logged into the members only area search for blog, then selected manage your blog from the results. We set up our blog, then walk through the horizontal tabs, spending the most time on creating a blog using free content. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. If you have any questions, please contact us using the contact information provided.